22 hospital foundations across the province have teamed up for a first-of-its-kind lottery that supports critical care and innovation. Split the Pot Lottery will split 50% of total winnings to 13 grand prize winners with a pool that grows larger every minute. Uh, joining us now is Paul McIntyre Royston, President and CEO of Grand River Hospital Foundation. Thanks for being here this morning. Oh, thanks for having me. It's always fun to talk about something that's a win-win-win-win-win-win-win. So <laughs> tell me this. First of its kind, that's, that's novel. So tell me how, how did this uh, initiative come together? Well, we knew we were having a lottery ourselves, and we knew so many other in the, in the community across the province have done lotteries. And it's like, okay, how do we make these a little bit bigger? How do we make it more exciting? And how do we help the hospitals more? And so we gathered 22 hospitals together across the province. Every single region's covered, and we're all in on this one lottery. And it's split, uh, as we we're kind of mentioning, so 50-50, uh, you know, half goes to the charity yep. uh, and, and the multiple hospitals. And, and the other side is kind of, this is kind of unique too. It's not just one person wins. A lot of people, and a lot of people yeah. want their opportunity to win. Well, a 50-50 is great, and you win the big prize. Yeah. But we were like, okay, this is probably going to be reasonably large. And so how do we split that up a little bit? So we actually have 13 winners. One person wins 60% of that prize. Two share the next 20%, and then the 10 share the last 20%. So everybody who's winning gets a really Really good amount of money. I like that. And we talked about critical care and innovation. Tell me a little bit about where the money that's raised on that 50% uh, goes. To the yeah, so from a hospital perspective, you know, we have to fund the equipment. That needs to be funded locally through typically foundations. And so we're looking for our own hospital, a NICU, so the neonatal intensive care. Yeah, well. We're talking incubators, we're talking those special lights, everything we need. So that's where our fund's going. But each of the 22 hospitals have chosen sort of their core area where the funding's going to go. Not everyone's a typical donor, as we were kind of talking about during the break, uh, but this is a fun way to, you know, ha have some fun with a game of chance and also know your money is going there. So where, where are we at in terms of, of I think the, the deadline is? Yeah, early we're deadlines tomorrow, tomorrow at midnight, and okay. then one week after is the final deadline. And we know the, the total money in is going to be over a million bucks, which means the prize is going to be over at least 500000 which is just awesome. Yeah, that's, right? a that's a huge amount of money to be split. And you can find out that ongoing total by going to splitthepot.ca so you can have fun along that. Tell me a little bit about buying tickets, too, because we've got up on the screen uh, how much it costs and the, your maximum. I saw a lot of people buying the maximum. Yeah, tickets. so everyone's buying the maximum, and it's 400 tickets for 60 bucks. And for 600 few, bucks. No, 60 bucks. 400 tickets for 60 bucks, but oh, oh, wow. the maximum okay, right. is 600 you're allowed, so 4,000 tickets. Oh, wow. So some people have gone to that level as well across the province. It's been really great to watch. That's, and that's a lot of tickets. Uh, you feel like you've got a pretty good chance when you've got like even 400, the best, Absolutely. the best going there. And it's a reasonable price too. You know, 60 bucks to get 400 tickets. Yeah. I like that. Uh, so how can people uh, sort of, uh, you know, we, we talk about going to the website uh, to follow along, but in terms of getting more information on where this money goes, because re you really moved me by saying, you know, neonatal and, and all yeah. these things. So on the site, we actually list all 22 hospitals. You can link right to them. And, you know, you mentioned this, the key part, right? It's, it, this is a season of giving. Giving. You know, we have Giving Tuesday up on coming up yeah. next Tuesday after Black Friday. And, you know, not everyone's a donor. You know, 50% of Canadians give, but everyone else, they still care. They just, they want to find their way to be supportive. And whether it's tickets, whether it's even merch that supports these hospitals, regardless. And whether you buy a Split the Pot ticket, support your hospital. You're yeah. going to need it. From birth right through the end of your life, there's going to be a need for the hospital. And talk you. about the, the need a little bit, too, because, you know, everyone thinks, oh, the, the, the government, you know, does it all. But then you, you hear from hospitals, no, it, it you know, it's a step. But you need a lot more money from the community to really get where you need to be. Yeah, the key thing to remember is when the province funds, like, new hospital builds, they fund 90% and the community has to come up with 10. Uh -huh. But when they're funding the rest of it, all the equipment, that has to be funded locally. You're funding those beds, the IV poles, all of that locally. And that's through parking sometimes. Yeah. But more, more hopefully, it's the foundation dollars. Yeah, and like I said, it's a win, 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 win. So the early bird deadline, I gotta, I gotta hammer this home because sometimes Tomorrow people go, oh, I got, you know, I yeah. got uh, weeks to go. You don't. Tomorrow at midnight is the early bird deadline, yeah. and then this is all going to be, you know, divvied out a week from now? Yeah, absolutely. A week Thursday. Yeah. A week Thursday, and then again, people find out if they want probably getting a phone call in the middle of the night. Somebody's going to be pretty excited <laughs> at midnight, yeah. Okay, I got, I got to hammer this home again. Uh, splitthepot.ca. Thank you so much for coming in, Paul. I uh, really Pleasure. appreciate this.